Hi everyone, Paul here from TechLink and I recently came across an issue with my laptop where the touchpad stopped working. So I wanted to share with you the solution on how to fix this if you find yourself in the same situation like I did. So I'm using a Lenovo IdeaPad gaming free laptop and basically what happened is I recently made some updates to my drivers using this software called Driver Booster and later on when I wanted to use the laptop without my mouse I realized that the touchpad stopped working. Now the first thing that came to my mind was that maybe I disabled the touchpad by accident and as you probably know you can do that by pressing the function button and the F10 which will disable and enable your touchpad but this was not the case. The problem was indeed with some of the drivers installed. So in order to fix this you need to head over to the device manager so you can just type in the search bar device manager and open it. Now obviously I'm using a mouse to do it but you can probably work around this and find your way in using the keyboard only as well. Once you open the device manager you should see a driver with a yellow mark on it like this one here. In my case this was in the keyboard section but it could probably be as well in the human interface devices or mice and other pointing devices. So right click on it and select uninstall device and you will see a pop-up window with a warning. Now very important at this step you need to tick this box where it says delete the driver software for this device and only then press uninstall. Once you've done that you need to click on action and select scan for hardware changes and you should now have the right touchpad driver installed which will fix this issue. So if I disconnect my mouse you will see that the touchpad is now working. And that's pretty much it. If you found this video useful then please give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comment section if it did or did not work for you. And if you want to find out how to install Google Play Store on your laptop then you should check out this video where I explain how to do it.